I stand four square behind the uh, observation that if if Joe Cox's sister having imagine the courage you need to take over or to try to get the job that got your sister killed. I, I do sometimes wonder whether I'm looking at the same planet as other people in this profession. Imagine your sister got assassinated for doing her job and you thought, right, I'll take over now, sis. That, that to me is a, an act of beauty that you never see in politics, particularly in this period. Kim Leadbeater thinking, right, I, it, it killed my sister. If Joe Cox had not been a Labour MP, if she had not been the Labour MP for Batley and Spence, she would be alive today. And her big sister, Kim, had a look at the lie of the land and she thought, right, I'll do it. And I presume, we haven't spoken to her, we will hopefully next week or soon, she had a look at the lie of the land and she thought, I'll do it for you, Joe. And people who call themselves Labour supporters are on the ground in Batley and Spen campaigning against the Labour candidate campaigning against the sister of the woman who was murdered by a white supremacist terrorist while claiming somehow to represent the interests of people who are victims of racism or discrimination. There are days, there are days when you wonder what the hell has happened to this country. And she only got in by 300 odd votes, so you will not be hearing any cheering from me. Just quiet relief and congratulation for Kim Leadbeater. I hadn't thought of it in those terms before. She looked at what they did to her sister. She looked at what was done to her sister. And she thought, I've got this. Obviously, it's not as impressive as having a massive flag in the background when you're giving a television interview to the, to, 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 to the BBC. But from where I'm sitting, that's the kind of conduct that is absolutely absent from the public space. She's an absolute legend. What an incredible thing to do. They killed her sister. And she thought, I'll take over.